Hey guys, first we start here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to download and install the Uber app on your iPhone. So the Uber app is a ride sharing app for you to use and it's a really simple and easy way to download and install on your iPhone. So before you can install it, first thing you want to ensure that you have internet connection on your iPhone either through a strong Wi-Fi or cellular data. But you'll need internet connection to download any apps on your iPhone. Once you have internet connection, the next thing you're going to do is look for the App Store app on your iPhone, which is a default app, and go ahead and open it up. Once you open it up, on the very top corner, you should see your profile icon, any of these pages that you're in. You're going to want to click on that profile icon and verify that you're signed into your Apple ID if you're not already signed in. And if you need to create a new account, you can create a new account by simply cre clicking on create new account which is free to do but in any case you'll need Apple ID in order to download and install any apps on your iPhone. So once you're signed in or you have created an account it's time to go to the search page here and then search for Uber just like that here and once you search for Uber what will happen is on the very first one of the results you should see Uber request a ride. This is the latest app and you can verify this is the correct app because it has 5.7 million ratings and you can see the get button here. We'll click on the get button here. Now a couple things will happen for you. Either it will ask for your phone's passcode. It might ask you for your Apple ID one more time. It might ask for your touch ID if you have a phone with a touch ID or face ID like mine's where I have to just double click on the side button and it verifies my face ID and it's starting to spin which is a good sign and then starting to download and I can exit out of the app store and then if I go to the very last uh, page here I should see Uber being downloading here and generally takes about a minute or two sometimes shorter sometimes longer again depends on your Wi-Fi and the or internet connection that you have usually on the Wi-Fi it's a little bit faster than data but again just have to be a little patient and once it installs we're going to go ahead and add it to our home screen here and show you how it appears on our home screen but at any time when it's downloading you do not want to click on it that will pause it and then you'll have to resume pause so just be a little patient while the download and installation does happen and then after that does we'll add it to the main screen that we have so we don't have to swipe all the way to the very last page every single time to find the app. So as you can see here it's still going. You can see a gray shade which means it's still downloading and installed but once that clears up that means the app is ready for us to go ahead and use. So we'll give it a moment or so. And the other thing is, if you do encounter this, you may not, is that if your phone runs out of storage, make sure you delete some apps or photos or video app to clear up some storage that you'll need in order to download apps, especially if you have a lot of apps. So as you can see here, it finally finished, and all we do is simply press and hold. So you want to press and hold and then add to home screen. And as you can see, it should add to your home screen, take you to that page, and you can click open. And after that, you can see the app has been open and we're ready to go and you can start by getting started or creating an account and you can request a ride. So that's how simple it is to download the Uber app on your iPhone. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching guys. See you guys next time.